It's unmistakably a Continental GT, um, but the hard work now remains to develop the car ready for the, uh, the race series in 2014. To drive the car at Goodwood, we invited our old friend Guy Smith, who won uh, Le Mans in 2003. Uh, well, this is his first uh, official debut here at the Festival of Speed. Um, we've done uh, literally probably 30 k's of testing with the car so far, so it really is a brand new car. But uh, you know, very excited about uh, getting into the development program and uh, start to put the car through its paces. GT3 is based on the road car, it has the road car shape, unmistakably a GT. It's the 4 litre V8 twin turbo as we use in the road car. The engine is allowed to be repositioned slightly to optimise uh, weight distribution. It has plenty of power and torque as one would expect from a Bentley. The big thing for me is the uh, 4 litre V8 engine uh, has so much torque and so much power. Um, already it puts a big smile on my face just how quickly the engine accelerates. rear-wheel drive, six-speed transaxle, sequential shift. The GT3 series also requires that we bring the car below 1,300 kilograms. So to do that, we have uh, stripped up wood, leather, chrome, um, the luxury items out of the car, and very quickly got it down to a fighting weight of 1,300 kilograms. Good-looking cars are usually fast cars, uh, much like the EXP8 was, so hopefully uh, this car is going to be a fast car too. It's great to see Bentley playing such a big part here. And of course we have you know, a lot of presence with our big, big sort of hospitality stand in the middle with road cars on it. And it's just great to see Bentley and all the other manufacturers making such a big sort of stand at this event. driving the 2003 Speed 8 uh, here at Goodwood and driving up with Guy Smith and we both finished first and second at Le Mans 24 hours in 2003 and it's so cool to see the cars again together. Yeah, this year we're very fortunate to have uh, both Le Mans cars, number seven and number eight. Uh, myself driving number seven and Debbie Brabham driving number eight. And it's the first time the cars have been seen in public in formation since the, the famous victory in 2003. It's fantastic that we were able to do that and uh, been able to put a show on for the fans. Oh, <laughs> my